A brand new Doctor Who trailer is on the way. A recent teaser has revealed the air date for a supposed long form trailer. Additionally, we have new teasers for the upcoming 60th anniversary special episodes. These Who Spy teasers seem to be giving away set details. One of the most recent one lines up with some filming we observed here in Bristol last year. We're getting very close to the 60th anniversary now, so it makes sense for the show's marketing to pick up. Many were questioning whether it was too slow or when it would happen. It's very typical for shows to start marketing within two months of a run up to the broadcast at this point in time. Anyway, let's look at what this new teaser trailer means. If you look at it correctly, there are some hidden clues. Greetings everyone, I'm Jack and welcome to Tide Essential. If you want to keep up to date on all the latest Doctor news, lore and more, hit that subscribe button to never miss a video from the team here at Tide Essential. You can also follow us on social media for daily updates on the Doctor Who universe. The other night, this brand new glitch trailer for Doctor Who was spotted on the BBC channels. It follows the same design as previous trailers. Those were released earlier this year and appear to contain footage of the three specials. The reveal of the special episode titles at the Eurovision event followed this. This new glitch teaser is teasing the release date of something bigger. Binary code is present once again. Thankfully, Doctor Who fans have deciphered this binary code in the trailer and have basically become experts on binary code at this point. The first part of the code fan translates as, their time has come. This is likely a relation to the Doctor and Donna. The phrase also makes me think we are about to get the release dates of these three special episodes for the 60th. I mean, time has come suggests the exact date and time for the three specials is about to be revealed. I mean, it's essentially needed at this point, at least the dates anyway. Continuing on, the other binary code can also be translated into more detail. Fans have figured out that it also says Saturday the 23rd of September. This is 5 minutes before the brand new series of Strictly Come Dancing starts on BBC One at quarter past 6. Now it likely means the new trailer, if it is that, will air at least 5 minutes before Strictly comes onto the channel. I'm not sure if it would be a full 5 minute trailer, that would be rather extensive. Perhaps a 2-3 to three minute trailer which would give us more content about the upcoming content for Doctor Who. Realistically, I could imagine this trailer similar to Coming Up on Doctor Who, therefore featuring content of the 60th anniversary specials. We could also get a brief preview of a series 14 with Shooty Gatwa. I'm unsure if they'll show that just yet, but it's worth considering when considering what we might actually get from us. Fans are also speculating on what dates might be revealed for these specials. Now my guess is it'll be 3 weeks in November, something like November 11th, the 18th and then the 25th. Then again, Sundays could work, my birthday is on Sunday the 12th so hey hey. Again, that's my personal note there. It could be Sunday nights like I just mentioned. I hope it is Saturdays. That would make more sense for Doctor Who fans worldwide if you ask me. Primarily if the 60 specials also air on the Disney Plus channel or Disney Plus service, you don't want to take into consideration American fans. We'll also need to wait and see. Before we move to some reveals for Doctor Who, fans have been talking about a comment from Sean and Russell T Davies. Originally, it seemed most to be a much bigger trailer for Doctor Who following Jodie Whittaker's final episode and the regeneration of the Doctor into the 14th incarnation. This trailer has never been seen. Some fans speculate that perhaps it will reveal the Toymaker or Beep the Meep, therefore it might have been too much too soon. For example, we know that one shot in the actual trailer, which is Shooty Gatwa saying what the hell is going on here, has been digitally edited. Davies previously revealed the background of the shot here has been digitally replaced. This is due to it revealing too much. Perhaps this new trailer this weekend might contain the full shot and give us a tease of what's to come. I mean, we could just tease more Doctor Who people, perhaps? But wait, there is more. Two new Who Spy bits of content have been revealed. The first follow the glitch teaser appearing online, almost like the BBC social channels for Doctor Who were taunting us. This is the face of some sort of clown in woodwork, perhaps inside a toy shop. Fans are comparing this clown image to the clowns in one of the toy makers games in the classic Doctor Who series, but also there are comparisons to other clowns that have appeared in Doctor Who before. Likely, it is related to the main villain of the 60th specials, and also the posters for the circus. Those posters have been seen on set dressings for the 60th before, both in a location in Camden, London for filming for the Star Beast, and in Bristol for filming of the Giggle. The Doctor Who socials also released a familiar sight for some of us. This was the TARDIS down an alleyway. Now, I was actually on location observing this when it was filmed. This took place on Broad Street in Bristol. It was filming for The Giggle, which we know as the third special episode. Many Doctor Who fans are confident they overheard something Catherine Tate said when exiting the TARDIS. She said this, What about Mel? As the 14th Doctor by David Tennant replied saying, Brilliant isn't she? 
Make of this what you will, but it could mean a character like Mel will appear in the 60th anniversary of Doctor Who. We know Russell T Davies has many surprises in store for Doctor Who fans, and things are going to appear in the 60th year. We also know that Bonnie Langford will return in the upcoming series 14, but when you look at one of her promotional stills, it looks like she's on the unit landing pad. This location was found by Google Maps at Bad Wolf Studios. Basically, the team had constructed a unit base helipad just in the parking lot. Certainly, we've got a lot ahead of us. So, are you excited for the upcoming Doctor Who trailer? What might it reveal? It may be the time for the actual air dates and times of these three special episodes, but we might get the actual confirmation of a behind-the-scenes Doctor Who show. Now, that would be fantastic. If you want to keep up to date on the latest Doctor Who news, lore and more, hit that subscribe button to never miss a video from the team here at Tidus Central. You can also follow us on social media for daily updates on the Doctor Who universe. That's it from Tidus Central. I've been Jack, thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.